Good morning, everybody. Coach Everton here with my son. Hi. What's your name? Liam. Liam. And Liam, how old are you? Nine. Nine years old. So uh, this morning's uh, video is about beginner footwork. Uh, but again, there's nothing beginner about it. So if you are a beginner, you can handle it. You just have to go slower. If you're a little beyond beginner, do it faster and faster and faster. This is all good stuff today. Uh, the topic is lateral dribbling, which means moving left to right while facing forward. Uh, this is something that players don't typically do in games. They tend to dribble straight forward, and that's something we want to change. We want to have the ability to change passing lanes, so the ability to dribble laterally is, is, is super important. And I'm going to show you five great exercises to uh, develop your lateral dribbling abilities. Are you ready to go? Mm -hmm. All right, let's do it. So in the, um, in the uh, Facebook event, I did post the worksheet. Okay, so I printed it off. I suggest you do the same. Uh, and again, if you go back and look at this video, uh, it's still gonna be there, so go check that out. Uh, follow the worksheet and do it until you're comfortable, okay? All right, so if anybody out there is watching, please say hi, throw us a comment. Uh, would love to hear from everybody. We definitely miss you guys, miss seeing you and working with you in person. But again, we're making do and we're gonna keep offering these up so, uh, so we stay sharp. So when we do see you again, we're not knocking the rust off, but we're just flowing right back into it. All right, let's get rolling. Okay, so Liam's gonna be my demonstrator today. So the first one is a uh, stop and go. So very simple, we're gonna push it with the outside of our foot. So both, I guess before we start, we've got two cones roughly five yards apart, okay? And the important pieces to this is that he's facing forward the whole time, okay? So we're gonna move from this cone to that cone on our imaginary line, and but we're gonna face forward the whole time. So all we're asking Liam to do for the first one is push it with the outside of his foot and then stop it. And we're gonna, we want this to be repetitive and quick and in rhythm. All right, ready? Begin. This is great, good. And stop there, good. Now you're gonna, when you get to that side, you're gonna switch feet and come on back. Good. And we're gonna go a couple more times, ready? Begin. So make sure you're square forward. Take a peek up every now and again. Look at the camera and smile. Good. We'll just stare at the ball. Take a peek at the ball, but then also, <coughs> Take a look up. Good. Let's go one more time. We'll go three times. Yep, yep. The last one. All right, good. So that's a stop and go. Okay, moving on to exercise number two. Box, box, roll. So for this one, William, we're gonna do it slowly. So this one, we're gonna start with our left, again, if we're on the left side of your, your setup, we're gonna start with our left foot. So you're gonna box it. Go ahead, box it once with your left, once with your right, and then you're gonna roll it across, okay? Um, box, Oh, do I say that right? Yeah. One, two, three, but it's gonna be on your right foot. One, two, three, four. so it's gonna be three boxes. So start on your right foot. So disregard the sheet, I, did, I said that wrong. So start with your right foot, box, three times. One, two, three, now roll it, good. One, two, three, now roll it. One, two, three, oh. and then we're gonna keep rolling that way. Okay, so come out and back here. So again, it's three boxes, starting with your front leg, and then one roll, but keep facing forward as you slide across this line. Ready, set, go. One, two, three, go. Yep, one, two, three, go. One, two, three, go. Mm. Good. And now start with your front foot again, so your left foot. One, two, three, roll, good. One, two, three, good. One, two, three, good. Good, and actually, uh, the comfort of our facility, you get the turf and there's no elements, so it's almost an unrealistic version of, of what you'd be dealing with with the game. So I actually like this, that it's a little muddy, we got the cleats on, it's wet, and we're trying to still be technical, so there's something to deal with there. All right, one more time there and back. Sorry, your front foot, front foot. Yes. Nice. Good. Other way. All right, moving on to the next exercise. Goes like this. My Drago wants to be part of our uh, program today, so hello, Drago. Uh, next one, scissor V. Okay. 
So what that means is we're gonna scissor with our back foot. Uh, let me just show this for a second. We're gonna scissor with our back foot, uh, sorry, our front foot, push it back, and then a V to go forward. So scissor with your front leg, push it back, and then a V to get out of it. Okay, so Liam, show us that. Scissor with your front foot, push it back, and a V. Good, scissor with your front foot. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Even the way I'm coaching Liam, I'm saying yes, yes, because there's a rhythm to it. And that's the important part. Don't put, add extra steps, extra touches. Do it exactly as it's described. Scissor, push, pull, push. It's, just, it's a four count to it. Ready? Yeah. Here we go. Scissor, push, pull, push. One, two, three, four. One. It's okay. Two, three, four. One, two, three. Three, four. One, two, three, four. We're gonna do that one again. And and just so the for the parents, especially at home that are watching, know what you're watching for. So the the rhythm is what allows him to go faster. So I can't just say go faster until he's got the rhythm right. So as soon as we see a one, two, three, four, and done well on repeat, then we can say, alright, now step on the gas a little bit. Now go a little faster. Okay? So <clears throat> Tighten it up, keep your rhythm right, and then, yeah, we gotta do this a little quicker. Here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Shorten it up, shorten it up. Two, three, four. So if we wanna go faster, we gotta go one, two, three, four. So if we wanna go faster, we've gotta tighten it up. Okay, so if we're looking for more foot speed, then we can't take such big movements. So what I want him to do for this last rep is shrink it all down, get more in in this space, and be a little more pitter patter with our steps. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Tight, tight, tight. Small, small, small. Yes, yes. Small, small. Good, 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 good. Yep. One more, one more. Good. All right. Well done. Well done. Good job. Okay. <coughs> next one. Uh, step over or reverse V. So we're gonna step over with our back leg, okay, that's this motion. So stepping around the ball, okay, we're gonna give it a push back. And then our reverse V is reaching across with our, our leg that's further, that's further away. So this is a reverse V, pull, push out, okay? And then we're gonna repeat those two moves. Step over, is that movement, take the touch back, reach across your body, pull, push out. So if that's one repetition, if doing this, 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 and this is one rep. I'd like to see Liam do at least four from here to there. Okay? You got that? Yeah. All right, buddy. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Good. And again, we're, we're looking for First, this is the rhythm right, is there his touch is clean, okay? Because I'm not gonna ask him to go faster until he's got the right sound and pattern to it, okay? So let's go one more time. I'm not gonna ask him to go faster yet, but I am gonna, I wanna see consistency in his touches. Go. One, two, reverse three, okay? Yes. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So no real rhythm or pattern to that repetition. So now we're gonna get a little more critical. But the first reps are about that, are about just exploring it, get used to it, okay? Now he needs to tighten down a little bit, get his four, four repetitions. So quick it up, ready, here we go. Yes, yes, good. Next one, next one, next one. Don't wait, no, don't wait, pull, push. Step over, touch, pull, push. Step over, touch, pull, push. Step over, yes, that was the one. Ah. So <clears throat> the mistake he's making, and again, I'm being ultra critical, okay? But the mistake he's making is after he does the step over, there's just an extra step before the next thing, or an extra, there's a, an extra couple steps before he does the next movement. So what I'm being critical of is this. So, and Liam, you can watch, because I want you to fix this. Step over. 
Okay? No extra steps. Touch, no extra steps. Go right to the next thing. And especially here, bang, bang. Go right to the next thing without those extra steps are you thinking. So don't so think a little less and try to catch the right rhythm. Yeah. Here we go. Good. Yes. Ah. And reverse feet. Good. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Grab it. Good. Do one more. Stop right there. Do one more. You're more comfortable going this way. I want to see you go this way. One more time. Yes. Yes. Without that stutter. Good. I like that. No stutter. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Good. Push. No stutter. Close. Ah. Good. And that little, that little uh, sign of frustration, that's meant to be fun. Okay? Right? You're having fun, right, Liam? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> so yeah. it's not... Yeah. It, it, so we should look at this like it's like the frustration of doing a, a jigsaw puzzle. It's enjoyable. We're trying to get it. We're trying to grasp it. But at no point are we, you know, it, is it is it a negative thing? Okay. So that's what we want. We want we want your player just out of their comfort zone, which you know, which he's he's right there. So he's about to get get it. Got one more on you. Yeah. Last time we're gonna move on no matter what. Here we go. Good. Right. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Excellent. Yep. Yeah. Good. Good. Beautiful. Good comeback. Good job. High five, high five, high five. All right. And last one we're going to do. Uh, well, let's back up, get out of this muck. Okay. Okay, we're combining a move and a change of direction. So the move is a sidestep. A sidestep. Starts you on this side of the ball, okay? And then you sidestep to the other side of the ball. Easy enough, right? So with our move with our front leg, just a little jab step. So we're gonna call that a sidestep. So one more time, sidestep. I'd like you to touch back, okay? And now our change of direction is a Cruyff. So we're gonna take a step up to create some space here and chop it behind our leg. So the whole movement is this, one, two, Three. Got that? Sidestep, touch back, Cruyff. Good. Sidestep, touch back, Cruyff. Sidestep, touch back, Cruyff. Okay, so first round, we're all over the place here a little bit. Keep working through it. It's fine. Sidestep, touch back. I'll fix you. Sidestep, touch back, Cruyff. Good. Sidestep, touch back. Okay, so <laughs> a couple places we struggled. Uh, we sidestep, we touch back, and now where does this leg go next? Up. Up. A couple times you actually went across like to step over. We, let's not do that. Just go up, not even closer to the ball. We want to be a little bit out of reach here. So again, sidestep, touch out. And I want to reach this ball, so just come straight up, okay? And then, <laughs> while I'm planted, chop it behind your leg. So it's not so much like this chop and kick your foot out. Okay, so one more time. Sidestep, touch out, Cruyff. Sidestep, touch out, Cruyff. Sidestep, touch out, Cruyff. Yes, yes. Don't, don't step so close to the ball. See, see. Good. You can see here. <clears throat> Side step. Touch out. Good freeze. Now take your left foot and put it about like there. Good. Now do your croy. Mm -hmm. That's it. Side step. Step up. Ah, step up. Oh, okay. You're, you're going too close. Side step to the left. Uh -huh. Step up. Good. Stay a little more on the left side. Uh huh. Yes. That part's good. Ah, ruined. Oh my All right, God. Let's come back the other way. Ready? Let go. Yes. Yes. Okay. Good. Keep going. One, two, three, four. Keep going. One, two. Side step. Push. 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 Good. 
Okay, and there you have it. So that, that was five great lateral movement exercises that you can do in a small space. Um, Leon's a pretty high level player and he was able to do it well, okay? Struggle through some of it, but at the same time, it's meant to kind of be that where it's, it's doable, it's not easy, and but you do it more and more and more, you get faster and faster and faster at it. So I thought Liam did a great job. Did you have some fun? Yeah. All right, awesome job, dude. And we'll be back at it today at two o'clock. I'll, I'll do something very similar, but it'll be tougher. Okay, I'll do some advanced footwork, um, but it'll be the same topic and I'll just add a little more to it. So join us today at two o'clock and we have more stuff coming up this week. So thanks so much for your time. Uh, really appreciate it. Show us your likes, your comments, uh, send us pictures, videos of you guys doing the training. Love to see it. Thanks again, guys. Really appreciate it.